Hey YouTube, what is going on? It's Black Tiger here. And uh, yeah guys, this, as you can see, this is a pretty special video today. But uh, yeah, thanks guys for uh, 5,000 subscribers. Pretty epic. And uh, yeah, thanks so much guys. And also I think uh, it just hit a million views also. So yeah, thanks so much guys. That's pretty amazing. I can't even believe it. Um, but... Yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. This is going to be a 5,000 subscriber uh, gaming setup here. So, uh, yeah, let's get into this. So, yeah, for first thing here, we've got the monitor, obviously. And it's a SyncMaster BX2450 by Samsung. Um, it's got mega dynamic contrast. I don't know if you can see that. And then over there, it's, it says the SyncMaster thing. And uh, yeah, it's LED, 24 inch, absolutely gorgeous display. There's my dog. There he is. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, there's the wolf dog. And uh, yeah, here's the computer, guys. Um, yeah, let me just get the information for this. Alright, so the information for this computer is uh, first off, it's called the gateway oh yeah wait I gotta include this chair here's the chair that I sit in it's not bad we got a guest chair over there for all the people who want to watch the gamingness they can sit there and uh, but yeah just so you know guys this is the family computer slash gaming computer that's why we got like a really good computer so I can work for everything and I must say, this is literally like the greatest computer ever. It hasn't even had one problem. And the only problem was because of me, because I downloaded a virus by accident. Um, yeah, I was downloading like this stuff that wasn't really a secure site. And at that time, we had a pretty crappy uh, security system on our computer as well. But uh, yeah. So anyways, guys, this is called the Gateway uh, FX computer, as you can see there. Pretty sure that's all what it's called, so... Yeah, you can see it says FX, and then, uh, yeah, it's got a uh, Windows 7 Home Premium 64-bit, and then it's CPU is an Intel Core 7, i7 processor, um, 2600, and uh, here, let's get a shot over here, and it's also got a 16-gigabyte uh, RAM, um, DDR3 memory, um, a, the HDD is a solid state drive uh, plus two tetrabyte hard drive or terabyte. I don't really know how you say that, but yeah. And then the optical is a Blu ray uh, super multi combo drive. So yeah, I got super multi combo going on there. And uh, let's see if we can uh, open this thing up here. Yeah, as you can see, there's the first drive there, second one there. I think they're both Asus. No. That one's just the standard one. This one's the one we bought after Asus. You can like um, uh, down, uh, burn discs and stuff with that one. And then you've got room for two optional other drives in there. Yeah, it's pretty cool as well. So lots and lots of space and room for expansion in this computer. And you can turn the lights on or off. Look at that, guys. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty entertaining, I must say. And we got our Sennheiser headphones here, guys. Very good. This is what I used to use to record my audio. And, uh, yeah, I must say it was uh, pretty horrible. But, uh, well, actually, sometimes it wasn't bad. It was depending on, like, really, it would depend on um, how much background noise there was. And, uh, yeah, we got ScanSnap scanner that my mom uses for work. It's a very good scanner, super quick. And we got random printer here. This printer costs less than the ink cartridges do, and uh, so far it's been great, so yeah, highly recommend it. It's an HP Office Jet Pro 8610. It's like 100 bucks, and it prints super quick, so yeah, it's good. And then uh, next, we got our Elgato. Oh, well, here I'll show first off the Diamond 1080 HD Game Capture. If you want to record Component, get it for Component. But if you're going to do HDMI, forget it, because this thing, literally, I was able to, like, barely, I was barely able to record one uh, video for my Xbox One with that, and then it just completely gave up on me. It just, like, rage quit. 
And uh, so yeah, if you want to record very good HDMI for a PS4, Xbox One, PC, get the Elgato guys. Oh wait, Elgato Game Capture, yep, very good guys, I'd recommend that. Then we got our power bar over there, not too much going on with that, lots of wires in it. Got this plant, and uh, I'll show you guys here perspective of the TV. If you're sitting here, which I always do, I sit at this table right here to record, uh, that this tree right there is always in the way, so that's what um, I mean by saying that the tree is in the way. But uh, yeah, here's the TV. It's a very awesome TV, guys. It's a uh, Aquas, Aquas Quatron 52 inch, I believe, LED. I think it's LED. I don't know, it could be plasma. Pretty sure it's LED though. But yeah, it's a sharp. It's a sharpie. Illuminati. But wait. Do -li ding 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 ding. <laughs> well, uh, yeah. And uh, yeah, we got uh, Michael in his uh, Progen T20 right there. But yeah, um, I'd highly recommend for like a gaming TV to get a stand that doesn't uh, enclose the TV because it makes it look way bigger than it is. Like this TV looks like a 60 inch because it's not in a cabinet. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And then, uh, so yeah, we got our, oh yeah, I forgot. The classic console, well fairly classic for me at least. It's the good old Xbox 360. Super reliable for me, I've, I took it apart um, two years ago I think. And I uh, completely uh, cleaned it out. I took everything apart and cleaned it because it was red ringing. And uh, yeah, I was able to fix that. So if you'd like to see a tutorial video on how to fix that, I can do it for you guys. Whoa, my hand's going crazy here for some reason. And uh, yeah, here's this random Guitar Hero thing. A whole ton of games. And uh, yeah, we got the Xbox One in there. Which everybody thinks looks ugly, but honestly, if you're gonna buy a quality a gaming console, who cares about looks? Like really, I'd buy anything for performance over looks. So I don't care about looks, except if it's a car. If it's a car, obviously, looks uh, matter quite a lot. But yeah, it's standard Xbox One there. Got a uh, Wii in there actually, and I don't really use that anymore. And a whole bunch of Wii games. I'll probably be selling that though. And, uh, yeah, what else? What else, guys? We got our modem down there. Um, super quick Bell Wi Fi, actually. Really good. Works throughout my entire house, and it's way up here in the top left corner of my house. So, yeah, it works everywhere, even in the basement. So, yeah, it's fantastic Wi Fi. And, uh, yeah, now we got our 360 controllers here. Two 360 controllers. We've got Turtle Beach. X Air Force Sevens, I think they're called XO Sevens. I think. Yeah, you can see their X. Come on, focus, focus. XO Seven, yep. But yeah, really great headset, guys. Uh, fits great, feels good. You got your trusty water right here and a free Mandarin cup. Very useful for gaming, guys. I highly recommend getting one. Uh, Xbox One standard controller here, and we got the other one here, which is on. Oh my god, oh look at that. Look at that. Look at how accurate that is. Look, let's see if we can get a shot here. Look at that. How unbelievable is that, guys? But, uh, yeah, let's see if we can zoom in on the carnage. Look at the carnage. That's what happens when you're an angry gamer. <laughs> no. But, uh, yeah, that's over a lot of use. My thumbs kind of, I always, like, put way too much pressure on my controllers. So, yeah, I tend to wear out the uh, toggle sticks a lot. Yeah, we got some remotes here and stuff. And then we got the wire collection over here. Um, believe it or not, all these wires are used. At least most of them are, at least. Um, bunch of chargers there. Oh, another 360 controller. I had to take, I had to take that one apart because they, um, what the heck happened to it? Um, 
Oh yeah, I spilt uh, like Gatorade in it or something. So I had to take it apart and clean it. And uh, yeah, that was not fun. So then yeah guys, we got our final piece of equipment here. The uh, blue, is this the Yeti or the Snowball? I don't know. I really don't know what this is. I think it's the Snowball, I'm pretty sure. I don't know, it could be the Yeti. Or is another one called a Nessie, I think, isn't there? I have no idea what this is. Yeah, if you guys know, put in the comments. But yeah, I forget what that is, guys. But uh, yeah, I think that's it, guys, for this video. Thanks so much for 5,000. Oh, wait. <gasps> we got the Sharp Sound Bar. Pretty great sound, guys. Um, if you're like a sound nut and you really want full surround sound, then you could get a full surround sound. But honestly, guys, this is like really good. It sounds pretty decent. And it actually does sound kind of surround sound because it's so uh, spread out. So yeah, I would recommend that if you don't have a huge budget for a sound system. And then we got, this is the power thing here for the sound. Hello! Digital one. But yeah, as you can see, your sound went on. We got a ton more wires back here, component cables. Some HDMI cables that I don't need. Probably get rid of those. We got the bell box for watching TV. And, uh... Yeah, I think that's it. I have no clue uh, what else I can show you guys. So, oh, we got some speakers. Guys, these are the best speakers in the entire world. I don't know how old they are. They're like literally ancient speakers. They're at least like 25 years old at least. But they are so good. They're unbelievable speakers. And uh, yeah, I've had these things for ages. They've never broken. Uh, fantastic PC speakers. What are they called? Altec Lansings. Absolutely fantastic speakers, guys. But, uh, yeah, I think that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this uh, gaming setup video. Slash, like, library room family setup thing. Slash gaming, slash work, slash... I don't know what. Oh my god, look at outside, guys. You can't really see much, it's my neighbor's house. But yeah, guys, peace. See you in the next one. Hope you enjoyed this video and uh, subscribe for more, guys. Peace out.